Hi, I'm with Badger Basket, here to go through the assembly instructions for model number 01854, which is the Blossoms and Butterflies doll bunk bed with ladder. Before we get started, make sure you have all the pieces required and that you don't have any damaged pieces. If you do, contact Badger Basket as shown in the end of the instructional video. Let's get started. For parts 1 and 2, you will need part A, which is the end panels. You will need four of part B, which are the rails, two of part C, which are the bottom panels, and you will need eight of the part G screws and eight of the part F wooden dowels. So first what we're going to do is put the rails into the end panel. When looking at the end panel, one side will be decorative and the other side will be pretty plain, but you'll see that there's two holes in four of the corners here. These are where the rails are going to be put into place. For these rails, there are two holes that are on the end and then there's a groove. The groove is going to go to the inside, but when looking at these ends here, one will have an insert and the other one here will have nothing. The insert is where the screw is going to go into and the bottom one we are going to put a wooden peg into or a dowel. So for example, I'll put this in the bottom one here, which is not the one that has the insert, because that's where the screw will be going. And then this will go into the bottom one here. So the peg will go into the bottom hole, we will screw into the top hole, and the groove is going to face into the middle. And then we're going to do the same on this side here. Again, screw hole is for the top where you'll see that insert and then we'll put the peg in the bottom hole. So peg will go into the bottom hole which will align with the bottom hole down here. Put a screw in the top hole here. Again making sure that these grooves are in facing in towards the middle facing each other. And I'm going to screw both of these into place. Now for this instructional video, I'm going to be using a drill. If you choose to also use a drill, make sure you have the torque on the low setting so that you don't strip any of the pieces. Otherwise, feel free to use a hand Phillips screwdriver. So now what we're going to do is we're going to repeat the same thing with the top two rails. Again, making sure that the peg goes on the bottom and you screw into the upper hole here. So peg into the bottom, groove to the inside like so, and we'll screw these two into place. After you have the rails in place, the next thing we're going to be doing is putting in the bottom panels. The easiest way to do this is to tip it up on its side here so that we can see the grooves that align so that the panels can slide right down into them. So we'll take this panel, put it in each of the grooves on both sides, and slide it as far as it can go. Once these are panels are fully down, what we're going to be doing is putting on the last end panel. So we'll take the decorative siding away, so on the outside um, from the middle, and then the side with the two holes are going to correspond again to those rails. Now for this part we need to put in those wooden dowels, or those pegs, into the bottom holes. So I'm going to put those right into place here on all four of the rails right away. Then I'm going to place this end panel on top, making sure that I have all the pegs into each of those bottom holes. And then we'll screw all four corners down.
For step three, you will need two of part D, which is the mattress and pillow set, and you will need one of part E, which is the ladder. Lastly, we're going to put on the fabric mattress into each of the doll bunk beds. Put on the fabric pillows and set up the ladder. And you're all set. That concludes the assembly for model number 01854, which is the Blossoms and Butterfly Doll Bunk Bed with Ladder. Remember, if you have any questions or concerns, contact Badger Basket as shown in the end of the instructional video. Badger Basket thanks you for watching. Enjoy!